So it's Thursday, I'm getting ready to do quite a strange thing I've not done before. I'm going to do a podcast today, a podcast interview. Um, I'll link it down below if it's gone live, but I'll link the Instagram account of the website that I'm doing it for. It's on cultural diversity and immigration and migration. Um, and for some reason, they've picked a talk to me. So I'm doing that in, I think about two hours time. So I'm just charging everything and checking that the internet connection to the website works and everything like that. Um, Ingmar is looking after Mia. They are having a nap together right now. Well, one's napping, the other one's looking a wee bit sleepy. And get in there, loving the white noise. And I'm just having a pre-work snack. Excited or not, this nonsense thing in the distance here means that it's officially Christmas here in Iceland. Christmas decorations have gone up. And the goat is and so basically it's a goat. The story of the goat that it's the sweetest monstrosity and that the manager of IKEA constantly taunts Icelanders with its presence. He wishes nothing, ha no happiness or joy for Icelanders and therefore he has this gold. So every year he tries to keep the gold from burning, but Icelanders do not answer well to such indignities. And so, if, if it's even a word, but mm -hmm. they burn the gold. So every year, and his last attempt, he has motion sensors, he has barbed wire, and he has, uh, yeah. Machine guns? No, not quite, but he has <laughs> barbed wire, electric fence. And really, there's an electric fence? Yeah, electric fence. Mm, okay. So, and the <laughs> only thing... Yes. Yeah. stupid. And the That's only the thing that I can guarantee this Christmas is that the gold will burn. <laughs> I would do it myself, but I'm a family man, a man of peace, but... Okay, you've also will. got us really lost. Why are we in this car park now? <laughs> it's Saturday morning and Mia is on the move. I'm gonna put the camera down and just record her turning from side to side. Or at the moment, I think she's only turning onto her left, but we'll slyly watch and check. It's so cute, so fun, but also she's just grown up too fast. <laughs> nap. Are you full of beans ready to go on an adventure? We're going on an airplane today. We're gonna go and see Grand Rosa and Auntie Steph yeah, and your cousins Eden. Yay! We're gonna see Eric. He might be at the airport for you. Yay! Let's get you all ready. We're almost all packed. If you know, you know. <laughs> suitcase inside a suitcase, so we can bring back more goodies. We did it. We're ready with one minute to go before Daddy loses his head with us. Get used to it, babe. I look like I'm smuggling the little polar bear out of the country. Please. <laughs> it's good, there are no lines, no queues. Straight to check-in, although the flight is delayed. <laughs> Yep. Here we go. We're nice and sleepy, ready for the flight. Thank you, EasyJet, for our delay. Thank you. So we're just going to board. We have to sleep.
the little monkey's got her own seat. She's quite happy. We're just waiting to see if the person over here arrives so that hopefully daddy can sit beside me so I'm not on my own with little Mia. Yeah. is magic at flying. We are pure magic. She's got her own seat, quite happy, flying away. Daddy's sitting here playing, having his time, listening to tunes. Mommy's having a hot chocolate. We're all happy. Yay! <laughs> set and I can hear geysers in the background. Carved a pumpkin in about three seconds and little baby Mia is enjoying her little friend. Yeah we've got my first Halloween outfit on and she's sitting upright. Such a big girl. Are you scared? Are you scared? Should we go trick-or-treating? Yeah. So we're just taking Ingmar to the airport because he's headed home. Mia and I are here with Grand Rosa over there for the next week so we are on our own <laughs> and um, she was crying in the back there so Ingemar started singing to her and we just realized that we don't actually have this as a recording so we need to get him to make that video so he's just recorded his voice singing so hopefully that will help when she starts missing her daddy her pabby um, but yeah we need to get Ingemar to sit down and sing to everyone <laughs> all his sweet. Icelandic no, you're going straight oh, no. over, sorry. Um, all his Icelandic songs. Bye! <laughs> she already misses you. Oh, baby girl. So this is our morning wake-up routine. Mia wakes up and wakes Mommy up with her giggles and stories. We have a cuddle in bed and then a change of bum. And then we come down. And she sits in this throne, in her little baby Bjorn throne, and she stares out at the garden and speaks to all the plants. <laughs> She's being very quiet right now, but she makes some cute little noises. I'll try and catch them. Yep, there we go. And then when she gets a bit bored of that, I give her the toys, and she typically just reaches forward and tries to eat them, but yeah, she does reach and play. We've come to Dalkeith Country Park um, and there is a really cool cafe and um, a shop here with beautiful stuff but boy do they know how to price. But they have an amazing park here um, for all ages of kids so I'm just going to show you around. Um, we brought Aidan so that he can have a bit of a play around but you can see the structures behind me. It's like, I don't know, something out of, I don't know, some kind of crazy children's book but it's pretty impressive. It really is at our first proper big play park. It's such a cool park. So here's one of them. You've got slides coming out, bridges, there's wobbly walks, a little cage that you run through, and then it goes over here to loads of different kinds of slides. It's super quiet. <laughs> um, and then over that way, you've got a smaller children's play park. And then that way, they're upgrading the play park. And then they've got wobbly walks and funny bridges there and then down here there's a massive slide that you can go all the way down to the river it just looks like it would be amazing it's a shame i'm not allowed to go on any of these things yeah here's the slide in this bit here and i'll try and show you there you go and it goes all the way down way down there towards the river how much fun is that and there's an elephant here a little climbing wall yeah, Mia, I can't wait till you're older and we can come here. Although I don't really want you to get too much older yet. <laughs> and then that was the cafe over there and shop. And then there's this beautiful structure down this way. If you want to take we're going to the
<laughs> what do you think of your first swing? Your first time in a swing? No. <laughs> Mwah. <laughs>